Hello guys! Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a wonderful week. It's Missy Maroon here and I'm here to talk about a couple products from Origins. And they're all mini sizes! <laughs> okay, so I'm doing a little review on three products from Origins. I got them all in a set on the on Black Friday in the Black Friday Sephora haul sale, sale, that's, that's the word, sale, um, which I got these for ten pro uh, ten dollars, goodness gracious, I cannot speak, I apologize. Um, yeah, but I got these for ten dollars, which is a pretty good bargain if you do ask me, in my opinion. Um, and I got Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask to Clear Pores. The Drink Up Intensive Overnight Mask to Quench Skin's Thirst and Modern Friction Nature's Gentle Derm Abrasion. Uh, you may recognize the Drink Up Intensive because this was in my 2014 favorites. Um, so, might as well start with this one, um, even though I'd probably use it after either of these two products, but you know, it's all good. So, this is a moisturizer for your face and my first thoughts of it was, at first I was like, whoa, that is a scented product. So if you don't like scented products, if you are sensitive to scented products, then I would not recommend this product for you at all. Like, just move along, wait, like, skip ahead to the rest of the video um, with the other products being reviewed. Um, but I actually really like the scent. It's a really nice scent. It's very fruity and tropical and delicious smelling. Yeah, but at first I was like, whoa there because <laughs> it is very scented like you can smell this thing from a mile away um then my next thought was this is really sticky and you know these two things are not adding up to uh, good prospects for this so at first i was like oh dang it don't really like this product shame then Obviously, things started to turn around for this product, and as I used it and I kind of got used to how it works and what to do with it, I started liking it more and more. Um, at first, I had to use this large amount on my face, and that's why it got sticky, because this does, like, it does have a natural little stickiness to it, like, no matter how much you apply, but if you apply a lot, then it's going to be sticky. Then, But if you apply just small amounts and really let it soak into your skin and just add more as needed, then, like, first of all, you don't really need that much because it gets into your skin really fast and it really just makes your skin very soft and supple, um, like, the day after or whatever, once the stickiness has kind of gone away. But, um, like, if you just use a little bit, then your face isn't as sticky. Um, yeah, so that's, like, the one thing I would say I don't like about it is that it does have a little bit of a sticky residue to it. But, like, you can wash that off in the morning, and it leaves your skin just so soft and supple and feeling very replenished. Um, I like to use this, like, every other night when I use my shower skin care routine, which is a very, like, attacking my skin, really getting rid of the bad stuff on it. Then I use this to just kind of bring that moisture back because some of my products can be very drying. So I like to use this, and it just makes my skin feel nice. Then, um, I haven't used these other products as much, but I do have opinions on them. Uh, Modern Friction is probably one I've used the least, just because it was just, I don't know, I feel like it's a little bit too chunky for my taste. And, I mean, I can take some pretty chunky, um, coarse things, because I do not have sensitive skin. Uh, but this one was just, it was a little too much for me, personally, um, I feel like I've heard a couple different people talk about how much they love this product, um, but personally I just I can't get over how thick it is because like I squeeze it out and like it pretty much is all just the chunks and it's like you know rubbing on your face and it kind of hurts a little bit in some places and so I don't I don't particularly love this product. Um, but I do remember it did leave my skin feeling very soft. It like definitely, definitely clears away like the gunk and makes your skin very, very soft and because it gets rid of like all the skin and <laughs> everything. Um, but this product overall, I'm, I don't totally love it just because I think it's a little bit too thick and too coarse and hard for my skin. Um, <laughs> sorry, I slapped my leg. Um, so if you have sensitive skin, then you would really 
really not like this product because I feel like it would just attack your skin and really hurt. Um, so yeah, if you have tougher skin like I do, then maybe this product could be like a once a week type of thing, like when you, like, or if you're like an emergency type of thing when you're having really bad breakout and your skin is just not looking good and there's like dry patches and stuff and you just need to clear that off, then I think this product would be really good for you. But otherwise, I don't, I don't totally love this product, but you know, I'll probably use it through. Then, him. Then the final product is the Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask, and I actually used this last night, so my thoughts are clear in my mind about this. Um, at first I was really confused by this, because like, okay, first of all, the color, it looks gray in here, but then when you squeeze it out, it's black, but then when you put it on your face, it's like clear and gray and black and all at the same time, and it's like, what color are you? Um, but aside from the color, um, I don't think this smells very good, first of all, which I mean, makes sense because it is charcoal. Oh, yeah, it smells kind of like glue and just not very good. So putting it on your face, you're kind of like, can't take the scent. <laughs> um, but other than that, it's pretty good. Uh, you apply it onto a damp face and you just spread it over and I find I have to apply a lot because like, I can't see it sometimes. Like, it just kind of blends into your skin, which is weird because it's like, like I said, it's like all these multicolors, one of them being clear, and so sometimes I'm like, are you on this part of my skin cleaning it up or no? So then I always apply, like I slather this stuff on, um, which, I mean, it's buildable. <laughs> if it was a foundation, that's what we'd say about it, is that it's buildable. Um, and it doesn't get cakey. <laughs> and then you wait for it to dry, which... I'm never quite sure how long it takes for it to dry and stuff, or even if it really does get all that dry. I, I kind of vary with the times that I leave it on. I just kind of wait there until it feels dry and it feels like it's tightening on my skin. I feel like I should probably leave it on a little bit longer than I do, but I'm not entirely sure because the packaging, like the little box of this stuff came in with the instructions where it didn't say it, just said, like, leave on until dry. And then watch your skin be renewed and replenished and your pores minimized and like just basically bragging about this product and you're like okay I get it but I want I want to know how long I should be like leaving it on am I leaving it on too long or too short of a time like tell me <laughs> Loki moment um yeah but I would say I actually I like this product I don't like it quite as much as other masks like called the other mask I have um but there are different types of masks um this is one that you wash off, the other type I have is a peel off. I prefer the peel off, but I do really enjoy this product. I, I'd say I use this every couple of weeks, like once every couple of weeks, just to like mix it up with my skincare, because I usually do a mask at the end of the week, and so I'll, I'll usually do the other one, which is my Cubella mask, uh, which was in my 2014 favorites. Um, but if I want to kind of mix it up and around, then I will apply this. And then it's just kind of like a different, it's a change of pace for my skin. And it does leave my skin feeling very nice afterwards, very, very soft. And so yeah, that's good. Uh, yeah, but that's all I have to say about these products. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next week. Bye! So much leg slaps.